Princess Grizzbot! And while you're in deep thought, I'll see if we can climb down from here. Whoa. I could call Tree for help. No, I don't want to. But I kind of have to. But I don't want to. I could, but I won't. Hi, True. Hi, Griselda. I'm kind of stuck on my balcony right now. I could totally get down myself, but if you're bored, I thought you might like to help. We'll be right there. Icy Pops will have to wait, B. <gasps> Just kidding. Good one! Ah, you had me totally. <laughs> Whoa! Still trapped on a balcony here. We're on our way, Griselda. <laughs> Zelda! Huh? <gasps> Hop into Floto! <sighs> Why do I have to do all of the hard work? <laughs> Thanks, Floto. You deserve some rest. I really could have gotten down by myself. I just thought it would be fun to have a play date, you know? Oh, my. Thank you. Calling True was my idea. <laughs> <laughs> True was amazing. I can hear you. Can it, True? Can it, True? Can it, True? You must love all those cheers. Who's amazing? I'm glad they're happy, but I'd just like to help. Sure, helping is probably good, but all that clapping, that's why you help, right? Nope, I just like helping. Oh. Yay, Trey! I don't get it. <laughs> sure, everybody cheers for True, but she has those amazing wishes to help her help people. Do I have anything as amazing as wishes? <laughs> well, do I? <laughs> you, Grismos? <laughs> Hey, you're right. True has wishes, but I've got Grismos. Yeah. And I have just the job for you. Thank you, Grismos! I can't believe I just thanked the Grismos. Come on, Perky! Use the trap door! <laughs> Royalty away! <laughs> Rainbow City, look at me! I'm as helpful as can be! <laughs> Clap your hands, say hooray! Thank Griselda, yeah! Wishes aren't for me. <laughs> Clap your hands, see her rain. Think Griselda, yes, that's me. <laughs> stomping here, stomping there. Grisbot save you everywhere. Giant robots are the coolest heroes of the day. I'm a hero. Now's our chance. Have no fear. Grizzbot is here. <laughs> thanks, giant robot man. <laughs> no need for thanks. You're welcome. 
Is that cheering for me? <laughs> Don't worry, Grisbot's here to save the day. I know, yes, I know, I'm amazing. But don't stop. Don't forget to tell everyone about your new hero. You've never had a lunch like this, Bee. An all-around, round lunch where everything is round. Rolly fruit, control balls, globy pie, and your favorite, Suzuni juice balls. If it's round, it's going down in my belly. That's also round. Something's happening outside. <laughs> Griselda? You look different. Did you change your hair? Oh, you noticed. True. Oh, funny running into you here on this street. You know I live here, Griselda. You visit me all the time. Perfect. Then you can just kick back at home. Have a nap. Finish our lunch. Because you and your wishes can take the day off. Princess Grisbot is on helper duty. Um, thanks? Oh, it's nothing. It'll be a breeze. Oops. There. Good as new. Do we say goodbye to the Rainbow Kingdom now or wait until after she's broken it? If Griselda wants to help people, that can only be a good thing. Right? Uh-huh, yeah. Um, yeah, for sure. For for sure. One day, I'm so nice to people. Ahem, Bendy Straw? Yeah, 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 yeah. table now. <sighs> well, at least it didn't roll. Why? Ah! I thought she wanted to do good deeds. These deeds are not good. I agree. Dancing like that is not good for anybody. That's not Griselda. That's Faruki. That dog does not have a license to drive a giant princess-shaped robot. Come on, B. Ah! Which way did it go? True, I simply cannot find my fabulous princess Grisbot. Never mind. Ah! Fruki! <laughs> Sweetie Muffin! You have to come down from there! Ah! Fruki! Yetis, of course. You're big and strong. Do you think you can stop the giant robot for us? are great at playing tetherball. <laughs> eh, not so great at robot stopping. Princess Grisbot is too big for us to stop by ourselves. We need some wish help. Oh, Cumulo! Take us to the wishing tree, please, Cumulo. <laughs> 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 What a 
unpleasant surprise. See? There's a giant Princess Grizzbot on the loose, and we need some wish help. Fast. <gasps> Psst. True. Don't tell the wishes I'm here. Huh? <laughs> What's with the stand, Easy? It keeps the wishes company when I'm not around. Your flat Z fell a little flat. Z? <laughs> flat Z! Back to the drawing board. And back to your copies, please, wishes. <laughs> Was there something you needed help with, True? Yes, yes, True needs help. There's a problem with the Grizzbot. <laughs> Princess Grizzbot, the fabulous giant robot my Grizzmo's made for me. Giant robot? Yep, and it's kind of, sort of. A lot out of control. Hmm, I'm sure we can find a solution. Let's have a sit and think about this. Uh, Griselda? I don't sit on mushrooms. Then why are we all sitting at a time like this anyway? It helps us think things through. Anyway, the Grizzbot is out of control with Fruki stuck inside. It's starting to wreck things around Rainbow City. How do you plan to fix the problem? Well, I need some wish help to stop the Grizzbot from stomping around. But I also want to keep Rainbow City and Fruki safe. My Fruki Wolfgums get so cranky when he misses his belly rubs. I'm sure the wishing tree can help. Mm. With the Grizzbot, not a belly rub. The wishing tree has heard you, True. It's time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. Please share your wonderful wishes with me. Please share your wonderful wishes with me. Wishing tree. Amazing or what? I guess it was a little amazing. A little? <laughs> okay, a lot amazing. These are very interesting wishes. Let's look them up in the Wishopedia. Oh, it's amazing! Thanks. Your first wish is Glue Boo. It makes a coating of glue so sticky strong, almost anything will stick to it. It'll have to be really strong if it's gonna hold Princess Grizzbot. Your second wish is bring it. It's a powerful <laughs> magnet wish that can pull any object made of metal towards it. Oh. You mean like my Princess Grizzbot? Don't you get a scratch on her. <laughs> <laughs> Your third wish is zillion. It can take one thing and poof, make it into lots and lots of that thing. So, if I had a diamond... I could make it into lots of diamonds! Or we could use it to help stop Princess Grizzbot somehow. Oh, that. Mm. Sure. Thank you, Z. And thank you, Wishing Tree, for sharing your wishes with me. <laughs> Good luck, True. Go grab that Grizzbot. You know? It could be so much more dazzling in here, with a little glitter, some jewels. No thanks. Thanks, cute <laughs> My grease spot. Ah! Oh, look out! Oh. Ah! Oh. Oh, I think Fruki heard me. Now's our chance. Let's see if Glue Boo can make Princess Grizzbot stick around. Zip, zap, zoo. I choose you. Wake up, Glue Boo. <laughs> Wish come true. <laughs> Hi, Glue Boo. Are you ready to help? Mm-hmm. Then let's make this road super sticky. Perfect. Is now a stuck bot. Princess stuck bot. <gasps> <gasps> you mean Princess uh, stuck bot? <laughs> 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 
that does not go with your outfit at all. Huh? Poor <laughs> Bartleby! I need to slow down that Grisbot, and I have just the wish to do it. Zip zap zoo, I choose you! Wake up, bring it! <laughs> wish come true! Are you ready to help? <laughs> okay, bring it. Show me how much metal you can pull towards you. Slow down! Ninja Kitty Dodge! I might need an extra hand. I'll give you two. Along with some paw power! <laughs> We're doing it, bring it! Come on! Uh-oh. <laughs> I guess you used up all your power. Thanks, bring it. Uh, Thanks for your help, too, Glue Boo. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. <gasps> Where is it going? Finally! It's going back to my castle. <gasps> it's going back to my castle! True! Do something! Two Griseldas, please. As fast as you can fly. <laughs> that robot can really move. How are we going to stop it, True? We've already used two wishes. Ooh. Well, my third wish is Zillion. He can multiply anything. But how can we use that to stop Princess Grisbot? It's not the robot we need to stop. It's Fruki. But what can we multiply that Fruki really likes? Well, he loves me, of course. And squeaky toys. And me. Bartleby, that's it. Fruki loves you. Giving him more of you to love will get him to come out, stop the Princess Grisbot, and save Griselda's castle. A little drool never hurt anyone. And the world can always use more Bartleby. <laughs> Are you ready to be more cats than you've ever been before? Yep. Set my Bartleby's free! Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! <laughs> Wake up, Zillion! <laughs> Wish come true! Zillion, can you make us a few more Bartleby's? <laughs> Thanks. This won't hurt, will it? <laughs> Not a bit. Wow. I'm three times, times more handsome, handsome than I thought. Ooh. Okay, Bartlebees. Get in front of the Grisbot mm -hmm. so Fruki can see all three of you. Got it! Fruki, over here! Who's got kisses for Bartleby? Here, Fruki, Fruki, Fruki! <laughs> it's not stopping. Uh, can you ninja cats get me up there? One, two, three! for all of us when I say, no problem. Come on, Fruki. Come on. Oh, good, Fruki. Uh-oh, the Grizzpot isn't stopping. Uh, here, Bartleby, take Fruki down. Gotcha. Cat's rule, Bartleby's a cool. Fruki! you go! Fruki's toy out of here. Oh, my Fruki's going to get stomped on if someone doesn't do something. Me, I have to do something. Grisbot's gonna 
was pretty great, wasn't I? <sighs> but nobody was around to see me do it except for you guys. Oh, but how do you feel? Actually, really good. For some reason. Huh, I could get used to this. <gasps> <gasps> Princess Grace Bodies destroyed! Oh well, I'll just have my Grismos build me another one. No! Kidding! I'll have them build a giant statue of me instead. They're a lot less stompy. La, 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 la. Da, 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 da. Ready to have Zillion turn you back into just one Bartleby? Bartleby? <clears throat> yeah, uh, not yet. I want to let Fruki finish with the other me's first. Please don't. <laughs> <laughs> Cosmic sneeze. Three, two, one. Come out, Bartleby! Come out wherever you are! With my ninja kitty hiding skills, True will never find me. <laughs> what? Uh -huh. huh? Little helpers, knock it off. You're giving away my hiding spot. Why? Wow! <laughs> I guess my ninja landing skills are better than my ninja hiding skills. <laughs> Huh? What was that? Sounds like someone's got a really bad cold. What's up? Huh? What's up? Whoa! Our house was not orange and blue before. I wonder what's going on. Let's see if anyone else's house is changing color. What's up? What's up? Whoa, each time we hear that sneeze, something changes color. <laughs> Amazing! <laughs> B, you'd better take a look at yourself. You're looking a little... Green? Huh, what do you think, Drew? Does it bring out the color in my eyes? <laughs> <gasps> Drew, your hair, it's pink! And almost as fabulous as mine! <laughs> Thanks, B. <laughs> It looks like the sneezes are coming from the Rainbow Castle. Oh, oh no! no. Rainbow, Rainbow King. King! True Bartleby. Oh, my greenness, I'm so happy you're here. Your greenness? Check out my greenness. I see what you mean. <laughs> I'm so sorry. It seems I've caught a nasty case of the Wachugi Boogies. What, Chugi Boogies? Yes. Uh, they make me very sneezy. And as you may have noticed, tend to confound my colors. I'll say. Everything changes color when you sneeze. But it'll be okay, right? Purple pumpkins, no. From what I've read, if I don't remedy my Wachugi Boogies soon, the color changes will spread and stay that way forever. Forever? There has to be some way to stop it, Your Highness. According to legend, the only cure is to be tickled by the feather of a Hinotari bird. It's a magical bird that lives high atop Mount Tippy Tippy Top. But it's so steep and cold and snowy, no one's ever made it all the way up. Well, we will, because we're gonna get you that feather. True, you mustn't. It's far too dangerous. You're our friend, Rainbow King. When a friend is in need, we do whatever we can to help. Isn't she the greatest? I mean, isn't she? Come on, Bartleby! Wait, before you leave, what should I leave? Yes, we're, we're us, us again! Yes, five, 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 five. Yeah. yeah! And uh, mm -hmm. please, dress warmly. Mm -hmm. Oh, Cumulo! <laughs> Bring us to Mount Tippy Tippy Top, please! And fast! We'll fly straight to the mountain top and get the feather. Oh no! Cumulo's got a bad case of icicle rump! The air's too cold up here for clouds. Cumulo's freezing! Hold on! Okay, there. The sunlight will 
pull you right back up again. <sighs> you know, this mountain isn't as high as I thought. It's way higher. It's too steep and cold and snowy to climb on our own. Now we need some wish help. To the wishing tree, Cumulo. <laughs> I need some ingredients, please, Wishes. That soup smells, um... <coughs> different. It's for the king. It won't heal him, but it should help him rest until we find a cure for his Wachugala... Wachuniwu... Wachuluhua... His cold. Sip? <laughs> I knew you'd like it. So how can the wishing tree help you? We have to climb Mount Tippy Tippy Top. What? That mountain is gigantic. I don't think that's a good idea. It's the only way to get a Hinotari feather to tickle the king and get rid of his Wachugi boogies. Along with my soup. <laughs> Your climb will be a challenge. Let's have a think about this. <sighs> so how will you get up there? Well, it's really steep and snowy. And cold. It's fur freezing cold. We'll need a wish to help us with the climb and a wish to help us with the cold. The wishing tree has heard you, True. It's time to get your three wishes. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. Amazing group of wishes. <laughs> Let's see what the Wishopedia says about them. Your first wish is Floto. It's a floating wish. It can float anything or anyone inside its bubble. That'll be great for getting us over those tricky spots. <laughs> now for wish number two. Ah, uh, yes, Warmo. It can heat up anything, like the delicious soup I made for the king. Yes, Warmo can melt the snow and the ice that's blocking our way so we can get to the top of the mountain. Yeah, best use for melting snow. Not so much for heating soup. And lastly, you have Blabby. Ooh, this wish is exciting. Blah. It's a communication wish. Blah, blah, blah. It can help you understand what someone is saying, no matter what language they speak. Hey, how you doing, True and B? <laughs> Amazing! I'm just not sure how a talking wish can help us get the feather for the king. Maybe I'm just a blabby mouth, but I say you'll figure it out. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Z. And thank you, Wishing Tree, for sharing these wishes with me. <laughs> Good luck, you two. Back to Mount Tippy Tippy Top, please, Cumulo. Cumula. Thanks. And look, there's a path. No need for wishes yet. We're off to a great start. Let's find that feather. They're nice and cozy, Your Highness. How about some homemade soup? Oh, thank you. <laughs> well, well, that's different. Oh, Z, what's that behind you? Huh? I didn't 
didn't see anything. Oh, sipped all your soup? I hope it helps. Oh, uh, yes. <laughs> I can feel it working already. <laughs> 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 I'm the same color as my soup. Whoa, whoa! <gasps> Thanks, True. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? <laughs> Slime time! <laughs> oh, that is a really icy hill ahead. Don't worry, B. We have a wish that can help. We'll float over it. Come on, Floto. Time to bubble up. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Floto! Wish come true! Hi, Floto. We need you to bubble us up and float us over that icy hill to the other side. Ready to float? get smaller when they get cold? I, I guess they do. But on the bright side, more kitty cuddle time, right? <laughs> True, did you grow a mustache? No, it's your tail, and it's tickling my nose. <clears throat> my whiskers are caught under your boot. Here, Floto, pop us out. <laughs> <sighs> Thanks, Floto. <laughs> You know what else is cold on Mount Tippy Tippy Top? Me. Oh, me too. Let's fix that. Warming hug. Mm. This book of sneeze cures should help ease your discomfort, Sire. First, apply warming cream to help clear the sinuses. Uh, I'm not sure, this is. Next, cover the patient's head in a warm woolly hat. I. I, 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 I. I don't think... Then, oh, playing soft music helps patients relax. <laughs> it's working! What you... 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 What's going on out there? What you... What you... What you... What you... <laughs> Flying photons! The whole city's gone crazy with color! <laughs> Are you okay, B? A little sore, but at least it didn't start an avalanche. Can we just pretend I didn't say that? There's no time to waste. We'll have to melt our way through. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Warmo! Wish come true! Let's warm things up, Warmo. So toasty. Just a bit more. There. Thanks, Warmo. Uh, True, it's gotten really slippery again. I guess melting the avalanche that fast made the path icy. No, we went three steps forward and a hundred steps back. Then we'd better start climbing. Just watch out for the slippery parts this time. Oh, I will. I will. Oh. <laughs> I'm a kitty cat, Sickle. Oh, gotcha. Oops. <gasps> Upside down, Sickle. <laughs> Sorry, Bee. True, the Rainbow King is getting worse. The entire kingdom is changing colors. Please 
Please hurry. Come on, Bertleby. We have to get to the top. Fast. I'll say. Stripes and polka dots? Yeah. Um, who's that? I don't know, and I don't want to find out. <gasps> it's a snow elfling. Wait, come back! Your hug was keeping me warm. <sighs> <sighs> Thanks, Warmo. Can I keep you forever and ever? Can I? Hi, I'm True, and this is my best friend Bartleby. Could you please take us to the top of Mount Tippy Tippy Top? What's he trying to tell us? To go home? We are so not going home. Snow Elfling, the Rainbow King has the Wachugi Boogies. To help him get well, we have to find a special feather from a Hinotari bird who lives at the top of the mountain. Why won't he let us pass? I don't get it. I don't know, B. We can't understand what he's saying. True, I got this. <coughs> Speaking louder <coughs> won't help. No, but we have a wish that can. Zip, zap, zoo, I cheat you. Wake up, Blobby. Wish come true. Hi, Blobby. Can you translate what the snow elfling is saying so we can understand him? Blah, blah, blah. Hmm. Uh, okay. Really? <clears throat> Don't take the path. It's the long way up to the mountain top. <gasps> it's, it's working. working. Oh, I did not know that. Back this way is a secret passage through the mountain. It's warm and it's safe and what was that? It has a great shortcut to the top. <laughs> Easy peasy mountain squeezy. I added the last part. Oh, yes! Thank you so much, Snow Elfling. Lead the way, please. Sorry, boy. Body big up. I with that. We made it! We made it! <laughs> Tastes like Z soup, but way better. Bartle, Bartleby, Bartleby, look. That's so nice. Oh. Hinotari Bird, we need your help to cure the Rainbow King. Your magical feather is the only way we can. And we only need one. Please. I would like to help you, but I'm afraid that I cannot. Huh? <gasps> Why? I only shed my feathers when it's summertime. Summer? It's not even close to summer up here. <laughs> Let's think about this, Bee. Warmo's still active, right? Oh, yeah. My fur has never been toastier. Then we can use this warm glow to help us. If the Hinotari bird only sheds its feathers when it feels warmer, maybe we can melt the ice so it feels like summer. Then she'll give us a feather. That's it. Oh, yeah. Feather weather. True, that's an awesome idea. <laughs> It's working! Ooh. Ah. Hey! Where are you going? We still need the feather! That was our last chance to cure the Rainbow King. <sighs> Thank you for warming me up again. I hope the king feels much better. We, we did it! Oh, thank you, Warmo and Blobby. This feather's going to a tickle party. 
Boo! Bortleby! The king is getting worse. His sneezes are draining all the color from Rainbow City. Watch out, Ah! Hurry! As quick as we can, Z. to the king fast. We need Cumulo. Oh, wait. Oh, he can't fly this high. I know what we have to do. We need to slide down. <laughs> An ice sled for sliding? Perfect. Thank you, Snow Elfling. Ready to rocket down the steepest mountain ever? Sounds terrifying. <laughs> Let's do this. <laughs> Rainbow City with no color? Me with no color? The only thing left with color is you, Rainbow King! Watch out, Emily! You're fading, too! One more sneeze and you'll be gray! Sapphires, I feel so much better. I'm cured. Thank you. <gasps> True, no climber has ever made it up Mount Tippy Tippy Top, the steepest, snowiest, coldest peak in the kingdom. Well done. When a friend's in need, we do everything we can to help them, sire. Like climb the highest mountain ever. If you want to rename a True and Bartleby Mountain, we wouldn't mind a action. Soup Bartleby? Huh. I thought only the Wachoogie Boogies made things change color. Okay, I take that back. Fee Five Fo Fruki! Yes! This tent is staying up! Only took me ten tries! I am awesome! Great job, Bartleby! <laughs> <laughs> hey, I forgot you were in there, True. Sorry. <laughs> Thanks a lot, B. Just setting up the sleeping bags. It's so beautiful out here. There's nothing better than going uh -oh. glamping. Glamping? <laughs> Glamorous camping. Everyone named Griselda is glamping these days. I still can't believe she agreed to come with us. There's dirt here. <laughs> you know camping is supposed to be roughing it, right? Oh, believe me, I know. I didn't even pack my sparkly bubble wash. Isn't that right, Fruki? <gasps> A puppy? Just the helper I need to find my long lost treasure. <laughs> Want a snack? I brought sparkly sandwiches. Who packed these? Those are glam witches. They're tasty and gorgeous. Just ask my fruity kins. He loves them. Nibbles time. <laughs> Fruki, glampers don't scamper. Hey. Be Fluffy, there's nothing better than a puppy, puppy, a puppy, I say. So fluffy and snifty, snuffing out treasure in a jiffy. Come get your glam witch. Ooh, true puddles. He definitely went in here. No, 
My snuggle pops will get washed in this big, horrible, nasty... Maze! It's a maze! And it isn't nasty, it's breathtaking. And you can't go in! Hey, Bartleby! Don't worry, True. I'll find a little drill machine in here. Somewhere. Who are you? Oh, clearly you've never heard of a maze troll before. We're meanies. Though, when I'm not guarding this maze, I'm actually quite nice. Why would anyone build something so unglamorous? <laughs> to hide my precious treasure from those who would try and steal it. But now my precious treasure's in there. For good reason. Between you, me, and the tree, I built this maze so big and tricky that no one can find my treasure. <laughs> <laughs> Not even me. But a dog with nose powers? Oh, your puppy pooch will find my treasure for sure. Mr. Troll, both our friends are in there now. We have to find them. <sighs> Fine. But the only way to enter my maze is to solve a riddle. How many berries from these baskets of plenty can you eat before your stomach is no longer empty? Oh, I'll find out. Wait, Griselda, we have to count them as you eat one by one. By one? <gasps> the answer is one. What? That can't be right. I've eaten way more than one berry. The riddle said, how many berries can you eat before your stomach's no longer empty? If you eat one berry, it's not empty anymore. Riddle sticks. That is correct. Oh, you may enter. <laughs> But first, let me give you a sneak peek inside. Whoa. Whoa! Fantastic, isn't it? One hallway becomes more hallways. Then doors begin popping up. Pretty soon, everything's all twisty and turny. And where will that leave you to? Lost! <laughs> Hopelessly! As I said, you are free to enter. But that doesn't mean you can stay in. Ooh, <laughs> I just gave myself a shiver saying that. <laughs> I am such a good meanie. What do we do, True? We'll never find Fruki and Bartleby in that maze. Don't worry, Griselda. We'll get them out of there. But we need some wish help to do it. If you're going to the wishing tree, then I'm coming too. You bet you are. The only way we can do this is if we do it together. Oh, Cumulo! <laughs> to the wishing tree, Cumulo! Ah! Griselda. The Wishes and I are camping. These three have even earned their merit badges. Camping sure is fun. Are we still talking about that? Camping was so five minutes ago. We're actually not here about camping. We're here about a maze. A maze? Ooh, I love puzzles. It sounds like fun. It's a giant maze that Fruki and Bartleby are trapped in. Oh, that's a lot less fun. Let's sit and have a think about this. No thanks. Princesses don't sit on mushrooms. Ah, put me down! Stay calm. Ah! Shh, shh. You'll be okay. The mushroom will come back down. Eventually. How can the wishing tree help, True? Well, this maze is really tricky. Ah! With walls that move around and everything. Ah! We need a wish that can keep us from getting lost. Ah! If we get stuck in the maze, we'll need a wish to help us get unstuck. Thanks, Griselda. Ah! You're welcome. The wishing tree has heard you, True. It is time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. Please share your wonderful wishes with me. Please share your wonderful
Well, these are some fantastic wishes. Let's see what the Wishopedia says about them. Your first wish uh, is Dot Spot. It can make as many dots as you need. Perfect! We can use Dot Spot to find our way back out of the maze so we don't get lost. We'll just follow the dots. Polka dots are fabulous. This is a wish with style. Your second wish is rope room This rope wish is a great help for when you need to climb things or to tie things together. That might be handy for pulling us out of a tricky spot. And lastly, you have Slothby. A rare and unusual wish indeed. This wish can put anything into slow motion. That's incredible! <laughs> I'm just not sure how slowing things down can help save our friends. I'm sure you'll find a way, True. I have to agree. And I'm always right. Thank you, Z. And thank you, Wishing Tree, for sharing your wishes with me. Bye, Z! Have fun with your camping whatever. Good luck, you two. I'm sure you'll do amazing. <laughs> Fruki! Fruki! Whoa, what's up with that? How do I get out of here? I, I, I should warn you, my Ninja Kitty skills are set for awesome. Fruki! Oh, am I happy to see you! Yeah, was happy to see you. Ugh. Okay, now careful where you step around here. This maze is filled with booby traps. Run! And we're trapped. Huh? Uh -huh. Hey! I get back here! Fruki, we have to get out of this maze! Yeah, okay, give, give, give me a boost. Fruki, this is no time to be sitting on your behind. <laughs> yeah! I take it back. Your behind is the best. <laughs> Wait for me! For me! For me! Did you hear that? It's Bartleby! We're going the right way! But how do we keep going the right way? There's so many hallways! We'll work together to find the right ones. But before we can go any further, let's make sure we can find our way back out of this maze. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Dark Spot! The wish come true! <laughs> Dot Spot, can you leave a trail of dots behind us as we walk? rub doo Sparkly pink? It's like he knows me. Fuggy, where are you? Bartleby! Oh. Very clever. The nice troll part of me would just leave these dots. But I need that dog to find my long-lost treasure. So... Mean troll it is! We've been walking forever. <laughs> Why does this keep happening? Griselda, look. You've fallen here before. That means we've been here before. We're walking around in circles. No way. How is that possible? I don't know. Dot Spot's still dotting, so we should have known. <laughs> Unless the troll's been stealing our dots. Oh, he is a big meanie. Without those dots to show us where we've been, we'll never get back out. We'll solve that problem later. Right now, we have to stop the troll from stopping us. 
Dot Spot, can you make us one big giant dot? Rabadoo! <laughs> Thanks, Dot Spot. That troll's gonna have fun trying to pick up this dot. Come on! <laughs> huh? A big dot? Like that? <laughs> Stop! Me! Oh, oh, oh. Spooky, hold on. We'll never get out of this maze if we get stuck. Okay, I'll go first, then you. <laughs> what did I just say? <laughs> ah, troll! <sighs> it's just a door painted like a troll. Eee! Ah, troll! Oh, just another freaky troll door. This one's worse than the last. I get that a lot. <laughs> to keep going through my maze, you need to answer another riddle. If you don't solve the riddle by the time this bird bath sinks into the floor, you must leave my maze forever. <laughs> riddle us your riddle, Mr. Troll. We're ready. It's the part of the bird that's not in the sky. It can go in the bird bath, and yet it stays dry. What is it? Whoa! It can go in the bird bath, yet it stays dry. Maybe it's a smelly armpit. Oh, I can't get a good look at it. Quick, try catching it! This bird is too quick. We have a better chance of catching its shadow. Shadow? The bird is in the sky, but its shadow is on the ground. And its shadow can go in the bird bath and not get wet. I know what the answer is. It's shadow. Riddle sticks. Right again. You may pass again, but I'll be around every corner to give you more riddles until you finally give up. See you soon. I mean, see you soon. How are we ever going to stop this troll from stopping us? Let's think about this. We need to get away from him, but he knows this maze inside out. Yeah, he's sneaky. We just have to slow him down enough so we can catch up to Fruki and Bartleby. And I have just the wish. Slothy! Guess who's back? Hold that thought. Zip zap zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Slothy! Wish come true! Hi, Slothy. Let's put the brakes on this riddle, ridiculous troll. <laughs> huh? Here's your next riddle. What jumps in the air? <laughs> But never comes down. You! <laughs> Ta-ta! Slowpoke! Stay with him, Slothby, and keep him nice and slow. Thanks! <laughs> this way! Whomp! <laughs> you couldn't have waited until I went through first? Princess is uh. first! You know that! <laughs> Fruki's collar! Blech. Remind me to add this to the Grismo's laundry list. Fruki! Where are you, my smelly collarkins? Smelly's with me! Over here! Wherever here is! Bartleby! We're coming! Must block them! <laughs> For wait, you're behind saved us last time. Keep going. Work that tail, boy. <laughs> you did it. Uh oh. Rookie. <laughs> Bartleby. True. I am so glad to see you. Did 
you miss me? <laughs> of course, Bartleby. Are you two okay? Yes, but we're trapped down here and Fruki's thinking about giving more drooly kisses. <laughs> Help! We'll get you out right away. Slothby. Oh, no, you're out of power. That must mean... <gasps> <gasps> yes, it's me again. No more riddles for you two. I'm kicking you both out of my maze. Now! Hold on. Uh, this pit. I remember now. This is where I buried my treasure. <laughs> the doggy found it! <laughs> my magic shillelagh! Riddle sticks. I can't get them out of that pit without my shillelagh. I am not leaving this awful maze without my frugikins. Do you understand me? Yes. Wow, you'd make a really good maze troll, you know that? Oh, don't worry. Mm. I have a wish that can help get everyone out of there. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, oh. Roku! Oh. Wish come true! Hi, Roku. I need your roping help to pull our friends out of this pit. Can you help mm. us? Oh, sure. Rope, 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 rope! Grab on, you two! Got it! Why are we moving? Fruki, let go of that thing! <laughs> no! It's my treasure! He's got it! Your treasure is no good if our friends can't bring it up because they're stuck down there! Oh, this is all my fault. I need to fix this. I'm coming to save you, Poochie. And me. Yes! Riddle sticks. Now I need a new shillelagh. And I'm not strong enough to do this on my own. Yeah, that dog has jaws of steel. Mr. Troll, we can help each other out of this mess. You want oh? us to work with him? He's been trying to stop us all day. The only way we'll get everyone out is by working together, Griselda. You got it! Ready, Roparoo? Uh-huh. Ready, Griselda? Uh-huh. I wish working together didn't mean having to hold a stinky feet. Ew! I watched them just last year. <laughs> oh, that's never good. <gasps> Uh-oh. No! Grab my hand! Come on, drill machine! Let's go! Pull with me, Roparoo! Uh -huh. uh. <laughs> 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 we did it! <laughs> Great job, Roparoo! Yay! <laughs> My <laughs> My treasurekins! Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, everyone! Working together did the trick! I knew it would! Your treasure's a dog bone? Yeah, a dog bone. That's why I needed a puppy to find it. <gasps> you put my precious Fruki through all of this just to get a little glittery dog bone? You are a meanie. <laughs> You're right. I've been such a meanie to you today. It's just to stop people from coming in the maze and getting lost. I hope you can forgive me. <laughs> Ah, <laughs> oh, here, this is for you. You kept saying you were a mean troll, but you can be a nice one, too. You just gave your treasure to my oh. treasure. <laughs> How can I resist this little cutie? I suppose it wouldn't hurt if you visit Fruki now and then. Really? Oh, thank you, thank you! Princess group hug! Ah. Oh. Uh. How are we gonna get out of here? Follow that super sniffer! Hey, glamping! What's glamping? It's sparkly. You'll like it. Come on! <laughs> <laughs> woo woo! Sky gloves! Z, a little early to be 
watching the sky, don't you think? The Lantern Festival hasn't even started yet. It won't be long now, though. Ooh, I can't wait to see our glow lanterns fill the sky with light. With light. Ah, well, you're about to see something else fly by that's just as amazing. Look. <laughs> sky globs? Wow, I've never seen them up close before. They only fly past here once a year when they migrate. Migrate? When it gets too warm, they head home to the chilly north. Woy, woo, woo! Ooh, I want to talk to them too. Woo, 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 woo. <laughs> I think they heard us. Yeah, chatting's not my thing. I'm more the strong, silent type who always keeps us cool, you know? Big Sam Blubs, Biggie Blubs, Sky Biggies, this, this thing! <laughs> they even have a cute blubby baby. Oh, hi, baby. With your big blubby baby mouth, a whole kitty could fit in there. <laughs> I don't see any wings. They must fly with their tails. Yes, they're very graceful flyers. It's landing that they're not so great at. <laughs> Ninja cat hide. Ninja cat hide. Can't see. Not, not wanting to be seen. Shivering with fear. Aren't they wonderful, Bartleby? Bartleby? Where'd you go? Right here, too. We should really be going to that non-Sky Blob Festival thingy, remember, that we were going to go to? The Lantern Festival. I almost forgot. Okay, let's go. Want to come with us, Z? Thanks, Drew. I'm good. I can see the Sky Blobs and the Lantern Festival from right here. It's the best view in the kingdom. Okay, Z, have fun. Gotta go. Bye. And you Blobs have a safe migration north. Right? Yeah! Okay, time to move with the groove. This cat ain't got hooves. Woohoo! <laughs> now that kitty can dance. <gasps> B, look! <laughs> what? Something's wrong with the sky gloves. <laughs> Ninja cat high. Great idea. Let's watch the festival from under here. In case, you know, it rains. <laughs> no, Bartleby. True. The sky blobs have turned around. What's going on? I think the music from the Lantern Festival is scaring them. That must be it. Because they're not going to the chilly north now. They're heading towards the steamy south. Steamy and warm sounds perfect. Not for the Sky Blobs. They only like cold weather. Hot weather won't be good for them at all. We have to turn them around. Can you stop them until we get there? I'll do my best. Ocumulo! Hi. Sorry we're missing the lantern launch, Bee. But we have to help. Yep, it's what we do. Time to hop aboard. Why aren't I hopping aboard? <laughs> yeah, legs weren't moving for some reason. To the sky blobs, please. Z, what are you doing? Trying to calm down the herd of sky blobs. Work on my sky blub call. <gasps> Easy little blub. It's okay. <laughs> oh no. 
They're so freaked out right now. We're gonna need some wish help to calm them down and turn them around. To the wishing tree, cute. Oh, right. <laughs> Oopsies. Thanks, Cumulo. Everyone okay? Yes. Did I forget to, um... <clears throat> Did I forget to mention that the sky blobs get upset easily? Yes, but we know now. Okay, there you go, little wish buddy. If I can just calm the sky blobs down, I can get them flying to the chilly north again. But how? That will be a challenge. Let's sit and have a think about this. <sighs> how will you get the sky blobs to fly to the chilly north? First, the poor things are so jumpy and startled by unexpected things. I need to make them feel safe again. Like how you feel when you're with people you care about. <sighs> how warm and lovey. The way you make me feel. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, Bartleby, exactly. A wish could help us do that. And if they're still spooked, then I'll need another wish that can lead them to the chilly north. The wishing tree has heard you, True. It's time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. Please share your wonderful wishes with me. Please share your wonderful wishes with me. Wishing tree. What fantastic wishes! Let's see what the Wishopedia says about them. Your first wish is... Ah, Tisway. It's a musical wish that plays music so sweet and enchanting that everyone loves it and wants to follow it. That's great! Tisway can help get the Sky Blubs to follow us too. For your second wish, you have... Sidebar, how sweet. It's a togetherness wish. It gives you that warm, cozy feeling, like when you're with somebody you care about. <laughs> I don't know what's come over me, True, but I love you more than ever. <laughs> a togetherness wish is perfect. It'll help the Sky Blubs see me as family and let me lead them to the chilly north. And your third wish is Deflect. Very interesting. It's a shield wish that can deflect anything that bumps into it. Psst. Can you deflect a sky blob falling out of the sky? Yeah, I just, I was asking for a friend. A shield wish is cool, but I'm not sure how it will help us lead the sky blobs home. You'll put the wish to good use, like you always do, True. Thank you, Z. And thank you, Wishing Tree, for sharing your wishes with me. Any questions? Just face bubble me. I know a lot about sky blobs. We will. Come on, B. Let's get our flying friends to the chilly north. Oh no! Look how far they've flown already. They're almost at the steamy south. You can feel the steamy heat all the way over here. Ooh. That steamy warmth is awful. Just awful. Yeah. Poor baby Sky Blub. She's really scared. Oh, she totally is. Quick, Cumulo. We have to get ahead of them fast so we can turn them around. And I have just a wish to make them feel warm and lovey. Then I can lead them away. All together now, side by. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, side by! Wish come true! <laughs> Hi, side by! We need the 
the Sky Blubs to feel like I'm part of their family, so they'll feel safe enough to follow me. Can you? Whoa! Phew! <gasps> side by? No, wait, side by! I want them to follow me, not Bartleby! What's happening? I'm tingly all over! <laughs> Even my tingles are tingling. <laughs> uh, what's with all this sky blobbing? Bartleby, they're attracted to you. To me? You mean like I'm their mama? No, 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 no. You're supposed to be their mama. You are. Uh, side by? Hmm? Can we try this again? Mm -mm. Well, thanks anyway. <laughs> I'm sorry, B. Side by only has the wish power to do that once. <laughs> Aww, the baby sky bluff really loves you now. Aww, <laughs> tell her to stop. I can't. Even the baby's mama wants you to be her mama. <laughs> yeah, well, I'm not ready to play mama. I don't even wash my own paws before dinner. <laughs> Until Side By's wish power wears off, you are their mama. But don't worry, you can calm them down. I can what? <laughs> Get it down! Bartleby! <laughs> hey, thanks, little blubster. Soft, squishy, good. Woohoo! <laughs> okay, keep it together, me. Sky Blobs, if we're gonna do this, you gotta. You gotta. Listen to your mama, okay? And your mama needs some space. Whoa, whoa. Thanks, guys. It worked! They listened! To me! See? You're a natural. Now let's lead them home. Right, home. Um, Sky Blobs? Whoa, whoa. Turn around, please. The chilly north is that away? Whoa. Gonna listen to your mother, me. Come on, little bobbies. We're leaving the steamy stuff behind. Nice work, Mama Bee. Thanks, True. That's all in a day's work. <laughs> this trip will be a breeze. Huh? <laughs> what? We're stopping. Yeah! <laughs> oh, we're going to Happy Farming Valley. <laughs> Whether we like it or not. <laughs> Oh, boy, that was terrifying. At least I didn't get squished. Oh, no. Are you okay, B? I'm okay. Clouds are as light as, well, clouds. Bring it in, B. I got you. Huh? Drew, why are you slobbering on me? No! Oh, hey! So this is why they landed in Happy Farming Valley. It's snack time. Yes, it is, and I like their style. <laughs> oh, B. You like tangy tum tums? Mm hmm. Hmm. Huh? Hmm. Hmm. I think they want to be fed by someone else. Someone named Mama. Oh. But their mouths are huge. What if I fall in? Fall in! Fall in! It's okay. They won't eat you. Are you sure? Pretty sure. Pretty sure? Oh, don't be scared. They love you, remember? And if anything happens, I'm right here to help. Okay, um, here's Sky Blob. Ooh. Get your tangy tom tom from your mom mom with the yum yums. <laughs> oh, well, can't say we didn't try. <laughs> maybe they'll feed themselves now. Maybe. Hmm, maybe. Hi, Z. We're having trouble feeding the Sky Blobs. They won't eat the tangy tum tums. Ah, try holding the fruit in your mouth. You mean like this? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wow. Smart, yeah. Mm -hmm. Whoa, are you okay, B? So much flobbiness. But it didn't eat you, right? No, she didn't. That's my super brave kitty. Come on, we'll need more tangy tum tums to fill those big bobby bellies. I can do this, I can do this, I can do this. It's feeding time! Baby 
feeding Mama Bee. <sighs> Thanks. Hey, fun fact. Sky Blob tongues feel like slobbery sandpaper. <laughs> okay, little Blob, let's get you and your family home. <laughs> Chili North, here we come. Uh-oh. Oh, well, well, what now? Uh, are you thirsty? Uh -uh. Itchy? Uh -uh. Need a belly rub? Uh -uh. What? What? She's just saying thank you, Mama. Woohoo! Oh, wow, you're welcome. Oh, Bartleby, <laughs> we're getting close to the festival. Uh-oh. Bingo Bango's still playing. The Lantern Festival is still going on. Oh, no, oh, no, oh, no! Sky Blobs, cover your ears! Plug them good, darlings! Oh, it stopped. Oh, good. Whew. And if the music's done, that means... Ready? Three, two, one. Lanterns away! Oh, look at that. Everyone's launching their glow lanterns. Woo! 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 Lanterns scary! Lanterns very bad! Oh, no! Poor little sky blobs! Now the lanterns are scaring the blobs! Stay away from my babies! Lanterns away from my children! Huh? What happened? I forgot the lanterns did that! When they land or hit something, they pop! <laughs> With the funny sound. That way, they don't leave any mess anywhere. Well, there's just way too many lanterns. Whoa. We've got to get rid of them all before my sky blobs go the wrong way again. But if we pop all the lanterns, we'll ruin the lantern festival. <sighs> what do we do? Let's think about this. Okay, let's think. If we could make a path for the sky blobs to fly through, then we wouldn't have to pop all the lanterns. Just some of them. Yeah, yeah, great idea. We'll use Deflect, my shield wish. He can clear a path by popping lanterns away. Right on, let's do it. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you. Wait, look, Deflect. Wish come true. Get behind me, everyone. Okay, Cumulo. Let's pop some glow lanterns. <laughs> Wee -wee. It's okay. Mama's best friend is taking care of those scary bad lanterns. <laughs> Sky Blobs, it's okay. Just listen to your mama and follow me to the chilly north. The sky is looking clear. It's time to skip the drama. We've got somewhere we ought to be. Better listen to your mama. I'm the head of this family. Here's what we're gonna do. We'll fly high up just like the wind and go woo, 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 woo. <laughs> Great job, Deflect. Ah. Nothing to worry about here, Sky Blubs. Whew. Now back in the bag. <laughs> we did it! Yeah, we showed those lanterns who's boss. Now nothing's gonna stop my Sky Blubs from getting home to the <laughs> chilly north. <gasps> Are those storm clouds? No! Nah, my babies do not like those. But Mama can tell these things. Let's land until they pass. <gasps> Whoa! <laughs> Good stop. This is bad. The storm clouds are moving in from above and below. So they're all around us? Not yet they're not. It's clear flying through Pointy Rock Canyon. But it won't be clear for long. We have to go now. I don't know, True. Z said the blubs scare easily, and those pointy rocks look pretty scary. And that thunder's scary, too. We have to think of some way to calm them down. <gasps> I've got it. I'll have Tizway play some relaxing music. That should keep the sky blubs calm and distracted. Tizway, I need you. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you. Wake up, Tizway. Wish come true! Hi, Tizway. We need some music to help us lead our friends through Pointy Rock Canyon. 
Flapping, so they'll follow us forward. Faster fin flapping music oh. coming right up. <laughs> Sky Bluffs, hey, you are the best. Baby Blub and all the rest sound off. Club <laughs> call. Woo <laughs> wee woo wee woo woo. Woo wee woo wee woo woo. Woo 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 wee woo wee. Almost there, we're nearly through. There's only one thing left. <laughs> the Chili North! We're here! <laughs> now I know why they call it the Chili North. <laughs> we helped the Sky Blubs get home. Can you tum tum any blub? <laughs> <laughs> Yicky! Bit less sandpaper tongue, please. I'm so proud of you, Bee. You were a great mama. <sighs> Thanks, True. Well, Sideby's wish power will wear off soon, though. Then the Sky Blubs won't see me as their mama anymore. Bartleby, Sideby's wish power doesn't last this long. It wore off ages ago. It did? So the Sky Blubs love me for being me? Yep. Just like I do, Bartleby. Uh-huh. Uh-oh. What is it, baby? What? <laughs> I didn't have a tangy tum-tum fruit that time. <laughs> I think that one was just a kiss. Aw, <laughs> Mama is so happy now. Queens of the day and night. Ooh, I'm so excited to meet the day queen and the night queen. <laughs> Making the sun rise each day and the moon rise each night is such an amazing, incredible, wonderful, amazing... Did I already say amazing, important job? It's amazing, all right. Sun comes up and I'm wide awake. Moon comes up and I'm... <laughs> the castle looks golden gorgeous. Oh, thank you for your help, True and Bartleby. You're welcome, welcome Rainbow, Rainbow King. King. And your timing couldn't be better. Here comes the Day Queen now. True? You okay? True? True? Warmest greetings, Rainbow King. And you must be True and Bartleby. It's wonderful to finally meet you. You know me? She knows me! It's delightful to see you again, Your Majesty. And your sister, the Night Queen, should be here any minute. Rainbow King, why do the queens only visit at sunrise and sunset? The Day Queen's power comes from her brightness, Bartleby. It fades at night, so if she's away from sunshine too long, she won't have the energy to lift the sun each day. Just as the Night Queen must stay in darkness to lift the moon. So my sister and I can only be together at dawn and dusk. Oh, that's so sad. I get to see my best friend all the time. Aww. Oh, and speaking of, here comes... The Night Queen! Night Queen! How glorious that you're here! Day Queen! Seeing you is always the best part of my <laughs> evening. Thank you for inviting me, Rainbow King. You're welcome. Ah, you must be true. And Bartleby, I've heard so much about you. You've heard of me too? I... Wow. <laughs> Oh, and here we go again. Night Queen, it's midnight marvelous to have you visit. And what a beautiful yes. moonrise you've made. Though the Day Queen's sunset is marvelous as well. Oh, thank, thank you, you, Your Majesty. Majesty. Nothing, Nothing beats, beats a perfect, perfect sunset. Moonrise. Oh, dear sister, surely you must agree the moonrise is more spectacular. I'm afraid I must disagree with you, sister. A sunset is the most beautiful. What do you think, True? Yes. Which one do you think is best? I, um, well, they're both great. 
<laughs> if only that were so. But clearly, my time is the best. Daytime is the best time. The shimmering sun in the bright blue sky. Nighttime simply can't compare. You really shouldn't even try. Nighttime is the best time. A soft cool breeze in the moon aglow. Daytime simply can't compare. Compared to night, it's just so so. Take in the colors and gaze at the flowers. Marvel at rainbows after soft summer showers. Relaxing in comets when dreams take flight. Count all the stars that twinkle so bright. Daytime is the best Night time. Is the best the time. The blue sky. The night stars. The sun. The moon. Oh my! This is perfect. <laughs> Crazy Sky is perfect? Don't you see? We can finally be together all the time. I just have to stay on my side. Well, I stay on my side. This is the best thing that's ever happened. Everyone, please excuse us. I must finally convince my sister that daytime is the best time. I'm afraid that's impossible because nighttime is the best time. Goodbye. Goodbye. This, this is most unusual. Most unusual indeed. Maybe it'll be fine. Daytime and nighttime? At the same time? More like crazy time. A little, but it's okay, I think. Please, please go to sleep. Oh, I can't believe that worked. So tired. Oh, oh yeah. yeah! Nothing can stop us now! See, you get the energy from the sun or nice, calming moonlight whenever you... Uh-oh. Oh. Looks like one of the buses fell asleep on the night side and the ones on the day side can't pass. What? <laughs> Come on, Bartleby. Excuse me, bus. It's time to wake up. Tickle, tickle. Come on. Tickle, 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 tickle. <laughs> <laughs> Good one, B. Excuse me, bus, but could you please pull over so the other buses can get by? Oh, I get it. Oh! Oh, oh true. I, I need your help in the Happy Farming Valley. Sure thing, Farmer Monster. I'm on my way. Oh, Cumulus! <laughs> Come on, Bartleby! Whoa! Hi, Farmer Monster. What's wrong? I know it's not too much sunshine. <laughs> Plants love sunshine! They sure do. All this sun was wonderful at first. My berry crop grew bigger and juicier than ever. Oh, giant berry. Where have you been all my life? But now, there's too much sun. My berries dry out just like that. <laughs> all that plump, delicious juiciness gone. Okay, maybe this half-day, half-night thing isn't working out. We can't leave the sky like this. Let's go explain the problem to the queens. They'll understand. Right? I still can't believe you're here! Be strong, True. Good day, True. And good night. I was just telling Day how lovely the night stars are. But they can't compare with the shimmering sun. Isn't that right? <clears throat> True. Right. Thanks, B. Your Majesties, both day and night are amazing and everything. But could you please put the sky back the way it was? Please? Oh, True. But that would mean I couldn't be with my sister. Huh? The sun and the moon will stay where they are until we decide to change them. 
Which we won't. Ever. Uh, well, well, what now, True? I think we're gonna need some help. To the wishing tree, please, Cumulo! Oh, I do. <laughs> oh, no! Oh, yeah! Hi, Z. What are you doing? Greetings, True and Bartleby. Look at the wishes. Half of them just fell asleep, and the other half are full of energy. I don't know what's wrong. That's why we're here, Z. The Day Queen and the Night Queen stuck the sun and moon together. Now it's daytime and nighttime all the time. Most unusual. And I need some wish help to get the sky back to normal. Whoa, that is a problem. Come, let's sit and have a think about this. <sighs> How can the wishing tree help? Well, I need a wish that can make the night side brighter and the day side darker. But even better would be a wish that can unstick the sun and moon completely. The wishing tree has heard you, True. It's time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. Those are some fantastic wishes, True. Let's see what the Wishopedia says about them. Your first wish is... Flecto. Now, this is a wish you can really reflect on. <laughs> I don't get it. Moving on. Flecto is a mural wish that can show your reflection. It can also bounce light in any direction. Wow! Oh, hello, handsome. <laughs> that means Flecto could bounce sunshine from the day side of the kingdom onto the night side to make it more like daytime there. That will really brighten things up. Your second wish is Zeplo. It's a blimp wish. Zeplo can take in a lot of air and fly way up in the sky. Big and floaty wish. Hmm. Maybe I could use Zeplo to pull the sun and moon apart. Your third wish is Shumpi. It's a protection wish. It opens like an umbrella, but can bathe you in sunlight while it's stormy and dark around you. Or cover you in deep shade if you want out of the sun. Hmm. I'm not sure how that wish can help me unstick the sun and moon. Uh -huh. But I'll think of something. You always do, True. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Z. And thank you, Wishing Tree, for sharing your wishes with me. <laughs> okay, bye, Z. Good luck, True and Bartleby. Okay, Bartleby, let's shed some light on Rainbow City. Flecto, it's time to reflect. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you. Oh, Wiggle, Flecto. <laughs> Wish come true. Hi, Flecto. Are you ready to bounce some sunbeams? <laughs> Great. Let's go. <laughs> It's working, but our beam isn't big enough. Flecto, can you get bigger so I can bounce more light down to the night side? Uh-huh. Morning, baby. <laughs> oh, there 
as good while it lasted. All right, uh, back to work. Uh, that's it? We covered all of Rainbow City. Great work, Flecto. <laughs> You true, but neither will I! Oh, oh no! Phew! Thanks, Flecto. V! True, I have bad news. Huh? I've made a model of the sun and the moon, and by my calculations, if they're not separated soon, they'll smush together into one big samoon with no sunlight or moonlight at all. <gasps> we have to fix this. It's time to see if Zeplo can separate the sun and the moon. No, oh, I hope it works, True. Good luck! This time, we're gonna do it. <sighs> hey, we're falling. Wait, wait. Probably just a dream. <sighs> it's not a dream, Bartleby! Cumulo fell asleep. Wake up, Cumulo! Yeah! We have to steer Cumulo to the day side so he wakes up. Lean with me, B. Lean! No! Ah Phew! Good work, Cumulo. <laughs> Come on! Time for some wish power! Zip zap zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Zeplo! Wish come true! <laughs> Hi, Zeplo. The sun and moon are stuck together. Can you help me fix it? Great. I'm going to guide you between them. Then you get really big and push them apart. Okay? Okay, Zeplo. Ready? Now, push! <gasps> Is it working? I only see Wish Tummy. <laughs> it's a nice tummy. Let's give Zeplo a helping push. <laughs> oh no! Cumulo! Catch the wish! Gotcha! Are you okay, Zeplo? <laughs> Thanks for trying, but the sun and moon are just too big to be pushed apart. You should get some rest. True, how goes the wish work? Have you separated the sun and the moon? Not yet. Whatever you're trying next, True, we have to hurry or... Sun Moon! There's only one thing we can do now. We have to get the queens to help us. Didn't we already try that? We did. <sighs> but we have to try harder. Thanks, Z! <laughs> Thank you both for meeting me. I know you love being together, and I love having you both together. But we have to fix the sky, your highnesses. What's the problem? Yes, we're having a wonderful time. But it's affecting the rest of the kingdom. <sighs> if you only could see both sides, you'd know. But I can't possibly travel to the night side. I'll lose my glow. And I certainly can't travel to the day side. I'll lose my darkness. Lose your glow. Lose your darkness. <gasps> I have a wish that can stop both those things from happening. I'll use Shumbi the protection wish to guard you from each other's time of day. Then I can take both of you anywhere in the kingdom to see what's going on. Well, I don't know. Hmm. <gasps> You've both said your time of day is the best. But how will you know for sure unless you see both sides for yourselves? Huh. Well, when you put it that way, how could we say no? Great. Come on out, Shumpy. <laughs> Zip zap zoo, I choose you. Wake up, Shumpy. <laughs> Wish come true! Hi, Shumpy. We need to get over to the day side of the kingdom. Can you protect the Night Queen for me? Ta -da, ta -da, ta -da. Oh, my! Fantastic!
fantastic. Cumulo! Huh? Huh? Hi, Cumulo. First stop is Happy Farming Valley. My word. Is it always so dry here? No. Happy Farming Valley is usually green and lush. But, oh, my glorious sunlight is drying it out. You always tell me how people are so happy during the day. <gasps> no! But I don't see that, sister. Neither do I. It's terrible. Look, B, they're seeing the problem for themselves now. So right. You're doing great, Shoopy! Now can you protect the Day Queen and go to the night side? <laughs> How marvelous! Sunshine at night! Would you look at that? What's everyone doing on the ground? Are they sick? Oh no, they're just sleeping. But they should be doing that at home. In their beds. Sister? You always tell me how quiet and magical and enchanting the nighttime is. But, uh, I don't see any of that here. Neither do I. It's not right. It's working, True. Yeah. Oh, don't fall asleep on me. Huh? Uh, right. Cumulo, back to the day side, please. Thanks, Cumulo. And thank you, Shimpy. <laughs> we see the problem now, True. Too much night is too much for anybody. And too much day isn't good either. It's time to make things right. Ready? Ready. The day is bright. The night is calm. Sun, moon, to where you belong! Another beautiful sunset. Thank you, queens. Daytime is a great time. The shimmering sun in the bright blue sky. We run and skip and jump and play. It's a fun adventure time of day. <laughs> Nighttime is a great time. A soft, cool breeze, the moon in the glow. Get comfy, get back, it's quiet time. We wind things down and clear our minds. Taking the colors and gaze at the flowers. Marvel at rainbows after soft summer showers. Relaxing and calm, it's when dreams take flight. Count all the stars that twinkle so bright. Daytime is a great time. Daytime is a great time. The blue sky, the night stars, the sun, the moon. They're both the best time. I like us both being the best. Me too. You did it! What is that? It's a face bubble. You've never used one before? No. no. I think we found another way for you to see each other more. Here we go. Your Majesties, no matter where you are, you can talk to each other by face bubble. Oh, now I'll be able to see you in the nighttime. Oh, and I'll be able to see you in the daytime. Hugs! Oh! <laughs> this is the greatest day and night ever! ever. <laughs> <laughs> we'll call you soon. Bye! For now! Bye, Day Queen! Bye, Night Queen! Bye! Bye! Wish gone wild! <laughs> Hi, Rainbow King! <laughs> Hello, True! Want to bounce with us? <laughs> It's so wiggly and jiggly and bouncy and boingy. <laughs> yeah, boing boing lagoon is the boing boing best. <laughs> wow. oh, oh, I'd love to stay true in Bartleby, but I found some wonderful new wishes in Wishing Heart Hollow, and I must get them to Z. Happy bouncy! Bye bye. <laughs> boing boing lagoon. Thanks, Rainbow King. Bye. Oh, what an eager bunch of new wishes, Z. They'll learn so much about their powers when you train them for true. Indeed, Your Highness. I'll have lots to note in the Wishopedia. Then I'll leave you to it. Rainbows away! Bye, Rainbow King!
Welcome to the wishing tree. My name is Z, and I'm here to take care of you. Now, what's this wish? Why, hello there! Aren't you curious? Hmm, that's worth noting. Great gravity! You're an eraser wish! No, no, that's not a bad thing. I'll teach you to control your erasing powers. I think I'll call you... Go away! <laughs> Wish is overboard. Stay right there, go away. Okay, go away. My table. My stuff. Where'd everything go? like a wish. That's weird. Whoa, I think it is a wish. Look out! Best ninja pose yet. Thank you. <laughs> True, Bartleby, a wish named Goey is missing. Before I could teach Goey how to control his powers, he got startled and ran away. That's never happened before. Oh no, that's terrible. Please bring Goey back to the wishing tree before the entire kingdom gets erased. We'll do everything we can, Z. Not true. Goey is heading that way. And our house is that way. Come on, B. Follow that wish. Don't erase our house! Don't erase our house! My cozy kitty loft! Oh no! My blanky blanket was in there! My fishy poof crackers! My favorite cushy pillow! <sighs> oh! I can barely nap on my emergency cushy pillow! I'm so upset. Great idea, B! We'll get Goway to have a nap! Oh, Goway! Would you like to have a snooze? True? A cat with no tail is like a cat with no clothes! Wait, I hardly ever wear clothes. Mm. <laughs> Aw, how thoughtful. Wait, I'm not wearing a rope for a tail. Don't get your tail in a tizzy bee. <gasps> Oops. I mean, don't worry. Once we help Goway get back to the wishing tree, we'll fix everything. Including my tail? Paw promise? Paw promise. Okay, I'm buying that. I'm here to fix your roof. I'll send you the bill. Uh-oh. Uh Goway is a powerful little wish. If we try to bring him back when he's upset, more stuff will get erased. Now we need some wish help. Oh, Cumulo! To the wishing tree, please. Yeah! Z! Uh, what are the wishes doing? They're guarding the Wishopedia. Aw, that's sweet of them. It's the only thing left that Goway didn't erase. Well, that and the wishes. Oh, I'm so glad you're all still here, Wishes. Goway is erasing lots of things in Rainbow City, Z. I know. We have to figure out how to bring him back, quick. So I can get my tail back, quick. I... All right. Let's sit and have a think about this. So, how do you plan to get Goey to come back? Well, Goey only erases things when he bounces on them. But when he's upset, he bounces on things a lot. 
Goei is upset because he's afraid of his own powers, and he doesn't know how to use them yet. A flower for a tail? Really? Hey, do you have one in blue? Oh. Thanks, guys. Goei won't be afraid if we make things fun for him. We should get some wishes to help us come up with a game to lead him back to the wishing tree. That's a great idea. Oh, I hope it works. The wishing tree has heard you, True. It's time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. Please share your wonderful wishes with me. Please share your wonderful wishes with me. Wishing tree. This is quite the variety of wishes. Let's see what the Wishopedia says about them. Huh? That page shouldn't be blank. Or this one. Or this one! <gasps> Thunderbolts and lightning! Everything in the book has been erased! Go away! He must have bounced on the Wishopedia and erased the pages by accident! Oh, don't worry, Z. If anyone can remember the wishes, it's you. <laughs> you look familiar. <laughs> wow, my tail's gone again. Wait, I can still feel it. How can I still feel it, but not see it? It's a camouflage wish, B. Of course. Hide Z. <laughs> this wish can hide something by making it the same color as the things around it. So it's harder to see. Ooh, that's fun. Yeah. Heidi can definitely help us play games with Go Away. Now, what's this second wish? Oh, this wish looks like a spotted dot. Or a dotted spot. <gasps> dot spot! This is a wish that can leave a trail of dots for you to follow. A trail of dots? Hmm. We could make a trail of dots to lead Go Away back to the wishing tree. That would be a great game. <laughs> And this wish da, 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 da. moves backwards. Okay. Can you give us another clue? Da, 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 da. Nah! I have no idea who you are or what your power is. <sighs> if only the Wishopedia didn't get erased. The Rainbow King is going to be so mad when he finds out. Just talk to him. I'm sure he can help you somehow. Thank you, Z. And thank you, Wishing Tree, for sharing your wishes with me. See you later. Good luck, True. Let's find Go Away, Cumulo. Oh, my tail flower! Follow the trail of vanishing stuff. Oh, and if you see my tail anywhere, just shout out. <laughs> Thanks, Kiwi. Oh, oh, you again. I don't do tail feathers. <laughs> my hair, it vanished. Just like that. Poof. Yeah, it's a good look for you. Say, it's really becoming. Wait till I show Mildred. Enjoy your new look. <laughs> oh. He's so bouncy right now. He's going to be super hard to catch. Hmm. We don't want to catch Go Away B. That'll only scare him. But we can make it a game. Catch me if you can. Oh, yeah! Ha! Ninja kitty time! No one's catching this cruel cat. Yeah! Every time Go Away comes to catch you, keep moving closer to the wishing tree. <laughs> gotcha. And to make it even more fun, we'll make it extra tricky to catch you. 
I have just the wish to help us. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Heidi! Wish come true! Hey, Heidi, we're going to play Catch Me If You Can. Can you show B how you'll camouflage him if he's about to get caught? Uh-huh. Ha-ha! <laughs> Ninja camouflage! <laughs> okay! Hooray! Catch me if you can! Come and get me! Too slow! Too slow! <laughs> I'll go away! I'm playing Catch Me If You Can with Bartleby. Wanna play? Over here! <laughs> Great! First one to catch him wins! Here I am! Ta-da! Over here now! You catch him, Go Away! It's working! Go Away loves this game! Oh, I am so caught! I mean, cool camouflage, Izzy. Nice moves, B. Keep it up, and we'll lead Go Away right back to the wishing tree. <laughs> no one's gonna catch me here. <laughs> you caught <crap> me! <laughs> oh, oh. <gasps> True! See a wish vanish. I just saw a wish vanish. Come on, we have to get Go Away back. Goodness greenness me. The entire Wishipedia has been erased. I'm so sorry, Your Highness. Uh, uh, it, it, it's all right, Z. Accidents happen. But you can fix it, right? And unerase everything? I can't fix the Z, but you can. You know every wish there is to know. You just need some help to remember them all. And the best way to do that is to retrace your steps. Retrace your steps? Yes. You think back to what you did step by step by step by step. Retrace and think some more. What did you do before? Use your brain and think a lot. You'll remember what you forgot. And that memory won't be lost. Our steps go back. Our thoughts rewind. Retrace, retrace. Our steps to find things we lost or want to recall. Retrace your steps. That's it. That's all. So, what wishes did you study today? There was flat, sir, the flattening wish, and goey, the eraser wish. Uh-huh. And yesterday? That was brushly, the brushing wish, uh, and boo-hoo, the crying wish. Oh, you're retracing your steps, and soon you'll remember the name of True's third wish. Let's have a think about this. Huh? <laughs> We're all out? Uh, we just missed Go Away. Oh, no. <laughs> Ooh, fuzzy! Okay, this has got to stop. You're just making me sad now. Got to stop. We keep trying to get Go Away to stop erasing things, but what if we gave him something that's okay for him to erase? Something he'd have fun erasing. Great idea, True. <laughs> But what's okay for Go Away to erase? Something one of my wishes makes. Zip, zap, <laughs> do I choose you? Wake up, dog spot. <laughs> Wish come true. Bye -bye. Hi, dog spot. We're going to play hopscotch with Go Away, and I need you to make a whole bunch of dots. I'll start hopping like this, and wherever you see my feet land, that's where you make a dot, okay? Woohoo! B, you follow Dot Spot, jumping only on the dots. 
Will do. But will Go Away follow us? Only if we make it look really fun. Musical dots? This is awesome! Yoo! Hop, hop, hop. Dot, dot, dot. Hop on dots. <laughs> Come play with us again, Go Away. For this game, you just hop from dot to dot. Don't worry. It's okay to erase these dots. Have fun with it. Hip, hip, hop, dot. dot. Hop, hop, hop. Dot, dot, dot. Hop, hop, hop. dot. dot, dot, dot. dot, dot, dot. <laughs> we're almost at the wishing tree. Which means we're almost about to get my tail back. Somehow. Hi, True. I just had my Grismobile polished to a crystal shine. Sparkle, sparkle! Oh, oh, now it's all spotty! Yay! Now it's all gone! Oh, no! We were so close to the wishing tree. And now Goway's heading towards the, the never-ending never forest. forest. I hope Goway doesn't go into Wishing Heart Hollow. Goway went into Wishing Heart Hollow. <gasps> this is where the Rainbow King collects all the wee wishes. Hey, Goway, come back, buddy! Snorful. The sniffing wish. <laughs> Splendid? Glue boo. Um, makes anything stick to its glue trail. <laughs> Does it ever? When Glue boo arrived, we got another new wish that day. It couldn't understand what I said. I had to speak backwards to it. Uh, and it moved backwards too. Just like True's third wish. That's the one! Well, why did it move backwards? Because. <gasps> because it's a rewind wish. Named Rewee! Ah, Rosie Rubies! You figured it out without the book! We have to tell True <laughs> right away! This is definitely a two-bubble call. Go away! <laughs> it's us! You don't have to be scared, little friend. Third wish. I didn't, but Z did. Yeah, a nice savey wish to save us would come in real handy right now. Your wish's name is Rewee. It's a rewind wish that can help you do things over again. Rewee only understands you if you speak backwards to him. And that gives me an idea for how to fix everything. <laughs> if I put Rewee and Go Away together, then Rewee can help Go Away go backwards and unerase everything that Go Away erased. Two wishes together? How very clever. True, that's never been done. It's brilliant. No, outrageous. No, incredible. Thanks. I'll let you know how it goes. Good luck. Okay, B. Let's help Go Away retrace his steps and unerase. Everything. Including my tail, my tail, my tail? <laughs> yes, yes, and yes! <laughs> Rewe, it's time to re-we. <laughs> I mean, rewind. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! <laughs> oh, right. <laughs> Z said we have to talk backwards to it. Zoo, zap, Zip, you choose I. Free, we, awake, true, come, wish. Hi, Riri. Can you help? Er, go away, help, you can. Backwards, go. Everything, on erase, left. Foot behind the other. <laughs> Step with one and then another. 
It's a different kind of race. Going backwards to that place. To find the things you huh? lost. Uh -huh. Retrace and think some more. What did you do before? Use your brain and think a lot. You'll remember what you forgot. And that memory won't be lost. Our steps go back. Our thoughts rewind. Retrace, retrace. Our steps to find things we lost or want to recall. La la la, la la la. La la la. Retrace your steps, that's it. That's all. <gasps> my tail! You're back! I'll never let you out of my sight again. See, I'm still seeing you. True and Bartleby, thank you for bringing Go Away back to the wishing tree. And for fixing the Wishopedia. Along with everything else. Love you. <laughs> Looks like everything's back to normal again. Thanks, little helpers. <laughs> I'm all good now. <laughs> <laughs>